Good morning. It's Saturday, March 16th, 2019. Has first official work trip outing for this season. I'm heading to Virginia State Road 615 to meet a colleague. And we're going to hike south towards Jenkins Shelter. I'm currently heading through the Big Walker Tunnel. Uh, we're going to hike south and do some trail assessment and look at future work for side hilling retread work. I always love coming through this tunnel. I just checked the weather app. It is 32 degrees this morning uh, with a high wind advisory. It is pretty chilly outside, but once you get hiking on the trail, that'll dissipate. You'll definitely get your blood flowing and the uh, internal engine going. Looking forward to it. This is Virginia Road 615. That's looking northbound, the AT is right behind that one lane bridge sign. Here's a beautiful bridge. And we do suggest for hikers to not filter water from this particular water source. Because there are homes uh, up, rig upstream from here. If you head north and back through the woods, once you head up on the AT, there's a spring uh, over there that is probably not as polluted. So FYI, if you're a hiker, bypass the, the creek down here, head north and get your water out of the spring up there. It is a very brisk March morning. Okay, we'll get we'll get a hold of that on the way out. Oh, there's a hall. Time for the up. It's uh, 9.20 a.m. now. Started hiking about 9, uh, excuse me, 8.45. Just taking a little break. Pack in my Pulaski. And if I didn't mention, we're heading southbound on the AT to Jenkins Shelter. It's either about four to four and a half miles from 6.15. To the shelter and we'll see what our timing is and we're gonna head a little bit north just to do some trail assessment for work later this year. All right, onward. There is a well We are two hours in from hiking south on 215. We're just shy of Jenkins shelter. Ron is taking care of a little bit of a slowdown that's obstructing the trail. That's a beautiful day. So here we are. We're at Jenkins Shelter. And there were some guys here last night. They had a fire. That's not a problem. A few embers that were still going. We could smell the fire when we came up, so I just hit it with some water. We, I was last up here last weekend of September 2018, and that's when we did some privy work. 
and just checked it out Rom's going up there this is his section but it does look like the cone already needs to be knocked down in my opinion that's what it needs to be happening happening Ron's going to go up there and check it out for himself it's up there through the woods and oh hunters Alrighty, now it is time to nail up the the new sign. I've got my nails here. I'll use a Pulaski as my hammer. I didn't bring one in. My tripod kind of bit the dust, so I'm not sure if I'll be able to even film this or not. We are on our way out. There's Ron. I had him stop here because you wouldn't think that maintaining a bridge after it's built is necessary, but when the leaves fall and the moss starts to grow, uh, it deteriorates the wood. So we're cleaning this out. I found a huge root growing up under here. That's a, another part of maintaining the trail is maintaining the structures that are on it. So, using some sticks in our hands, and we're going to clean this out. So, here's some of the root growth just growing right here on the bridge. Off you go. Well, okay, right, now we have a cleaner bridge. We had the brooms up at the shelter, but... I'm not going back for the broom. I don't think it's going to help this. Yeah. You need something that's going to throw your bristle on it and make it shelter. Yeah. So heads up, David A. <laughs> now that this is your section, every year, annual maintenance, go ahead and clean this house. We're having roots and other things growing. I going to say... I'm presuming I have permission. Pardon? <laughs> I said I'm presuming I have permission to you have permission. film you. I gotta deny you permission. That's <laughs> all that work you did on the side here. So there's a blow down here that got a hold of a rhododendron and that's got its limbs right across the trail. They are low enough to catch a pack. So we're taking care of this. We are heading out now. So here I am at the end of uh, Saturday. It is 5.26 p.m. Ron and I started at around 8.30, 8.45 here at the trailhead at 6.15. Probably did 10 miles round trip for hiking. Got a little bit of work done. Uh, that's, the, that's the goal. Anything is better than nothing. Uh, I will drive home tonight, which will be about a three and a half, four hour drive. But this wraps up Paz March 2019 work trip season. Um, that's it. See everybody next time. Bye.